Please, help! Captain, over there! Those people are under attack! Uh-oh! I just locked eyes with a Rocco! It's coming this way. Watch out! You have my gratitude. It's by Lavena's blessing that I've met you all. I thought I was done for. Did those Roccos and Lobs jump you? They usually stick under boulders. It's rare to see them behave like that. My thoughts exactly. I've lived on this island my whole life, but this is new to me. I heard the beach creatures had gotten vicious, but didn't realize how bad it really was. A lot of people stop here for the Urna flowers. This is bad. I need to warn everyone when I get back. Thank you, Traveler. Wait... Captain? Milia? The Roccos and Lobs are acting so weird. They've gotten pretty ready. Maybe they've started to see this beach as their domain. We're not done yet! They're... demon markings! No wonder the Roccos and Lobs are so agitated! This was the last place I expected to find demons! Lavina Island seems so peaceful! Don't worry, Evelyn. We know how to deal with demons. Besides, they've already moved on. These markings are all that's left. Still... demons on such a lovely island? I'm worried. We should take a look around, just in case. The Brelin Dominion saw demons less frequently than anywhere else, right? It's also the farthest dominion from Rockstar where the dimensional gate is Demons are popping up all over the place these days. Is anywhere safe?
Listen! There's something over there! It might be Milia's back! <sighs> no, this isn't mine. Huh? Someone's waving at us. Hey there, youngsters! Have you seen my pack? I lost it while trying to get away from those lobs. Can you help me find it? It's a matter of life and death. If I return home without it, my wife will kill me. Then my precious babies will starve. <gasps> Is this your pack? It was lying on the beach. Why, yes. Yes, it is. Thank you so much. I put all my grog meat in there. Would you care for some? Consider it a show of my gratitude. Huh? Huh? This isn't enough meat. Meat, huh? Like the kind those Roccos over there are eating? Look at that Rocco go! Taking a big old chomp! No! My precious grog meat! Please, I need it! Whatever's left of it anyways! Captain! Milia! We gotta hurry before all of it gets... Not much meat left, is there? <laughs> Maybe we can help Captain... <laughs> So this is all we have. A shame. Let's see if some lob claws will do. Claws. It's not meat, but it should be enough to keep my wife happy. I can return to my family with my head held high. I can't thank you enough. No worries. By the way, do you happen to know a kid named Benny? Benny? Of course. Is that ruffian causing you trouble? I saw him running up the hill over there. Is he nearby? I hope to find him with my pack, preferably in one piece. Pray that kid didn't eat what's inside my pack like those Roccos did, Captain. I sense a suspicious presence in that direction. Let's check it out! Look! Benny's over there! You... you little thief! Stealing is bad! Bad! You hear me? Give us back our pack! What? I didn't steal it! I was only borrowing it! I need to practice if I want to be an awesome adventurer! And... I don't have your pack. Some thieves took it. Borrowing my butt. Taking something without asking is stealing. And you lost it. What now, Milia? It's all right, Evelyn. If we know where it is, we can get it back. Where did they go with my pack? Their hideout is over by the coastal cliff. That place is a hive of scum and villainy. And thieves. I bet they're already going through your stuff. No way! Still, Millie is right. We just have to get it back. All right, 
Let's get those thieves. Wait, wait, wait. Take me back to the campsite first. I'm scared monsters are gonna get me if I go alone. Well, you got here alone just fine. Uh, but you're right, it's dangerous. Captain, why don't we bring Benny back to the campsite first? Good idea! <laughs> now let's hurry! I hope they didn't open it yet. I need to get it back before it's too late. Captain, Evelyn, I'll take on the thieves myself. What? M Milia, you're going alone? <laughs> I have to act quickly. You two take your time. Uh, she ran off again. At least we know where to find her this time. Yikes. I knew it. They're everywhere. <laughs> They look much meaner than the ones from early. a close one. Hey, is that... It's my sister! Benny, you've been up to no good again, haven't you? I am so sorry. I'll make sure this never happens again. You apologize too, Benny. Now. Uh, I'm sorry. Really. I won't do it again. <sighs> We're really getting our daily exercise in, aren't we? The thieves are at the coastal cliff, right? Well, Benny's back home safe, so we should go help Milia. We can't afford to waste more time and lose Milia again. Hopefully we catch up to her. This is taking longer than expected. Castle and Lats aren't going to be happy. Wait! I have something to tell you before you go! I'm a man of pride and virtue. When I apologize, my word is my bond. I... I can't get your pack back for you, but I can give you this. It's a super rare, super awesome treasure. To repay you. For your help. Treasure? We're not broke enough to take some kid's treasure. Uh, then again, it's rude to refuse a gift. And if it's actually valuable, it'll make Castle happy. What do you think the treasure is? Well, check it out. Sure, but I don't think it'll be useful. Even a simple marble could be a treasure to a kid. There's something poetic about that, I guess. This must be it, Captain! Look how rowdy it is! Considering how things look, Milia was definitely here. Let's ask that guy over there if he knows where she is. Hey, what happened here? Wah! Oh. Don't scare me like that. I thought you were that woman. I used to think my boss was scary, but now... Someone yelled something about an intruder, but this time I turned around. She was already right in front of me. She moved like lightning. 
She had me on the ground before I even knew she was there. If I ever get my hands on her... <laughs> I don't even need to hear the rest of the story. I know what happened. Let's find someone else. I, I didn't steal nothing. I never saw no pack. You'd better not be lying. Captain, there's someone over there. Hopefully they've got something more useful to say. Sure did. Saw every last second. And a merchant's eyes? They don't lie. No siree. The thieves were swept clean by a single night. Those damn dastardly thieves. Full of trickeries and lies. If anyone deserves beating, well, it's that lot. Cute. Just as I thought. Milia wouldn't just sit back and wait for the cavalry to arrive. That knight's our companion. Do you know where she went? She headed up that way, chasing the remaining thieves back to their boss, Rolf. The guy's a lot scarier than his underlings. Best be careful around that killer whale. Cute. of a challenge. Pretty disappointing, honestly. At least there were a lot of them, so it gave me a good warm-up. Wow, you're the only person I know who'd say that. More importantly, what happened to your pack? No luck there, unfortunately. And I forgot to ask the boss about it before the fight. But he did drop a key that looks pretty important, so that's something. 
It can't be any ordinary key if the boss was carrying it around. Well, now I'm curious. I need to search for my pack anyway. So why don't we find the lock that goes with this? <laughs> Captain, let's ch What do you think we'll find? I'm... There has to be something valuable stashed here. Otherwise, why would they keep it so well guarded? I don't like this. Maybe they'll move if we ask nicely. just doesn't feel right. Hmm? Is this... a jewel? It's pitch black. I think I get what you mean, Evelyn. Do you feel it too, Captain? Yeah, Captain. I've got a weird feeling. Look, there's also a map. Hmm... Do you think these scribbles are some kind of writing? Looks like it could be some ancient language. But who knows? Maybe Castle or Lats can shed some light on this. Hmm, yeah. Castle knows all about treasure, and Lats knows a thing or two about unusual items. I'm sure they can tell us something about this stuff. It's unlikely these things belong to those thieves. You and the captain both sensed something ominous. There may be a darker secret behind them. All right, then we should take them. These objects, plus those demon markings... Mm, we definitely have to look into this. Too bad we didn't find Milia's pack, though. Perhaps we could ask a penguin merchant about it. They might have some info on the jewel in the map as well.
mine's gold. Then a penguin's is platinum. Make it quick! Hey! Aren't you that jellyfish who wiped out those bandits? We found a map at the thieves' hideout. We couldn't make head or tails of it, so we decided to bring it here. You came to the right penguin! I'm a master decoder after all. Let me see. W well, <clears throat> uh, I forgot I was counting money. Uh, Mondrin, though, he's free to help. Just don't forget that I'm better than him. Hi, the penguin merchant told us to speak to you. We want to learn more about this map. Can you tell us what's written on it? Oh, and would you happen to know anything about a pack stolen by thieves? Which of the hundreds of stolen packs are you talking about? <laughs> Ask someone at the guard post. Finally, my humble teacher Dadipi is giving me a chance to prove myself. I don't know if a mere wandering scholar like myself can help with this, but I'll have a look. This map, it's... Hmm, it's rather crude, but it uses a particularly rare cipher. It's pointing to the Terong woodlands. The rest of it is illegible. It looks pretty ragged. Anyways, there's no doubt that it's showing the Terong woodlands. The rest is up to you. <laughs> Wait. Castle and Lats. They're waiting for us at the Terong woodlands, aren't they? Perfect! They can help us search the forest! First things first. We have to stop by the guard post and ask about my pack, Captain. <laughs> <laughs>